Oh. Hello guys, welcome back to the Let's Give Me Our Own Words and Nerds Out Dark Souls Remastered. Yes, yes, I've been waiting for this for I do not know how long. I have no idea. Right, uh, so let's get to the bottom of this page because it's a very big ass page. It's the same one as I'm presuming was slapped into the network test, which you have to scroll to the very down bottom. <sighs> let's just get to the accept part. Thank you very much because we've got a lot of shenanigans to get to. So we do, we've got like a lot of fun to be had, because we're going to be doing an intel. Can we stop with the amount of shite? We've got, uh, so we're, 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 so, uh, the way we're going to work it is uh, we're going to play this. Uh, we have to make an intelligence file, because the next one that, a uh, thing, medubiter, bubiter, um, what you call it? Um, hang on with there. Uh, backstep, you know, where's the jump button? Jump, 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 jump. There we go. There we go. Is that one done? Okay. See if changes. Yes. Right. So we are going to be going with LMG Mage because we're going to be running a Mage file. Uh, because the next um one is going to be we're going to be female. Um, the next one that we're going the next top ten is going to be magic based. So we're going to pick the sorcerer. We're going to pick the master key. Yes, um, and then we're going to pick Slim, and then Face, uh... Take the most normal looking one, so we'll go with the commoner, her... Um, I don't know which... Pigtails? I don't actually know, I'll go with the pigtails, and then we're going to choose colour, and dark. Oh, look, they actually have a dark purple. Lovely. Uh, and accept. Uh, yes. So, yeah. Um, like the odds is, everybody's already seen this. So, let's get to the playing. So, yeah, this is going to be fun. I've been waiting for this for I do not know how long. This is just going to be your basically run of the mill playthrough, caster style. And then hopefully, all in all, everything should work fine after that there. I have been looking forward to this for I do not know how long. I have got so much fun to be had. So I do. I've got, I, ooh, ooh. The amount of fun that will be had will be absurd. Can we just, like, get through the uh, grinding sessions of it? Because, um, other than that there, I'll be running this playthrough alongside a low-level playthrough. So I will... And then after that, there's just a shit ton of shenanigans after that, so it is. So, basically, all in all, it's just going to be a hell of a lot of fun. I'm going to be covering this game uh, ever so thoroughly, because I didn't exactly get to cover it massively whenever it was on uh, the Xbox 360, due to the fact that, well, one, we didn't have, um, what you want to call it? One, we didn't have... Oh, my God. Um, Dark Souls was kind of, like, dying out at that point. So it was, so now that it's back, oh, I cannot wait. As you can see, um, well, I muscle memory kind of hasn't left me yet, so this is this is quite this is going to be quite fun. So it is, but um, yeah, I'll be giving tips and tricks tips and tricks while I'm running about here like a lunatic uh, on meth. Right, grab that and let's go. So yeah, basically there's just going to be a shit ton of shenanigans to be had, and obviously a dagger is not exactly the most um, applicable at this point, but. Unfortunately, it's one of those things that we have to do. Dagger's not exactly the best starting weapon, but... We don't have our catalyst yet, and that is primarily what we're going to be focusing on. So it is. Let's go. Well, dude, how you doing? Bye. Yeah, I, I'm not in any patient... I'm not in a patient mindset here at the moment, so... Yeah. It's this flask. Behave. Wow, that damage is pitiful. I need a longsword. I need a longsword now. So I do. I need like a longsword, like um, preferably like right now. Oh, but we do get our catalyst. Let's cram that one on there. No, behave. And obviously because we're oh well, because we're a caster, we get to have like shenanigans like that there. Casters make this, casters is like easy mode, 
like honestly guys it is purely easy mode because once you get into the like, I think there's only what actually I don't think hang on I don't I think there might be only maybe one or there's only a ha I do know there's only a handful of bosses that are heavily resistant to magic but I don't think there are any let me think Is there any particular ones that are actually heavily resistant to magic? Oh, I nearly got smooshed. Stop. Behave. I need... Like, this is just, like, the cheesy of the cheese. So it is. So can you, like, stop? Thank you, GG, bye bye, job done, and woohoo, first ball's down. Yeah, <laughs> it's not exactly difficult, like, and I got a free humanity for it, but yeah. It's not like, mage playthrough is not exactly the most difficult playthrough, given, but, um, all in that there, like, it's hard to say, like, obviously you don't have the same, like, quality of life changes as the... Well, there is a few, like, in first, there's a few quality of life changes from here till anywhere else, basically. But in, in the end, up, majorly, you're going to be having a good day anyway. So, uh, yes, Farling Shrine, rest, and we're good. Reach Lauren. Yeah, Lord Run. English Mark. Right, let's grab three humanities. Happy days. Couple of souls that we're gonna run around and pick up and da -da 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 -da. talk to you because you're actually part of a covenant and you're one ugly looking motherfucker. Right, could you just keep talking? Yes, hurry up. Ah, oh, come on! Where's the right covenant? Yay! Join the covenant for now because uh, God only knows why I'm doing this here. I'm a fucking idiot. So, um. So, uh, purchase item. Uh, oh, uh, he sells miracles. Oh, the relatively low rank miracles. You get the covenant. Uh, oh, you also have their, his gesture, which is shrug, which is just hilarious. And then you can just talk to him, and then there's like nothing else really you have to talk about. So, moving on. Uh, yep, my memory's not too shabby at the minute. Happy days. Right, and then if we drop in here, and then over here. Then down here, we should get a talisman, a morning star, and homeward bones. And I think there's actually red eye orbs here too. And then there's Lloyd's talismans as well. That's an odd bonus. Right, that's that all out of the way. Let's go grab our Lloyd's talismans. Booyah. And then we're going to attract some very unkind skeletons, which is a case of we are not going to bother with them. We are going to run away like a scared little chicken. Because at this rate, uh, skeletons could probably wipe me out quite easily, which is not very high on my to-do list. Just being honest. Not very high on my to-do list at all. Now, let's move on and pop. And rest of the bonfire. Exit bonfire. Move back up. Because then that resets to the spawn locations. And we are after another soul that is currently tucked away in here. See? My memory's not too shabby. So it isn't. Uh, thinking of it logically. Right. Uh, we're going to be taking a somewhat of a different route to where we're going to, which is probably going to annoy a lot of people, but this is kind of the way that I do it, so don't get too pissy with me. Plus, it gives you access to an early game hard-hitting spell. It, yeah. So it does. Right, let's pop our souls. Ha! 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 Oh, yes. That is, that is what I am locking. That is Beautiful. Soul of a Nameless Soldier. Always good. And stabby, stab, stab, stab. Stabby, stab, stab, stab. 
obviously our dagger does like little to no da damage. Get off. There we go. And move down to this guy here, which a lot of people probably don't know that's in here. And we are. Can you talk to me, mate? There we go. Right. So he can. He's actually an upgrade person. So reinforce armor. No, no. Purchase item. There we go. Heavy soul arrow. Four thousand souls. Are you taking the Mickey? I only have one of them, so it doesn't make a difference. Ooh, four thousand on the dot. Well, four thousand and four. What is he? Oh, it's just the sorcerer's catalyst. There we go. So now we've got our early game high powered spell, which is just beautiful. Somebody's somebody else is already here, and he's being a cleric. Tasty beans. So now that the fact that we have um, little to no souls, we're going to do the most utmost stupid thing that could ever possibly be imagined. But it's just one of those things that you sort of do. You think about it, and well, it's a case of well, if I don't do it now, then I'm gonna have to wait like ten hours to do it. So we're going to do it now and hope to God the frame rate doesn't die. So far so good. Wow, the frame rate has actually managed to sustain itself. That is actually fucking remarkable. Uh, bearing in mind, most people are probably thinking, oh, why are you doing this here? It's a suicide gaze. Uh, that's kind of the point, but uh, you get something very damn important out of it that you really would like to get as early as possible. It stops you from dying so badly later on. See you later, kids. How we survived that? Don't look at me. <laughs> I'm going to be honest. It's not meant to work that fast. But okay. Right, so we picked up something very important. And obviously, um, we don't actually have any souls to level up. But we do have a new spell and a tune. It actually comes with three. Beautiful. Right, so now we've got a heavy solar, which means that our spell now... We can now deal decent damage. And uh, now we're going to give our Firekeeper's soul to this little baby here, which increases our healing potential. Now, technically what I would do is, is take the roundabout way, but considering uh, considering we're playing it this way, we may as well just do a full playthrough of it and be happy about it, basically. Uh, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna twist it. I'm not gonna turn. But we've got it. We've, like seriously, uh, as of right now, we have got a better start than what most people would probably end up having. So that hits for 82. And I've got 30 of them. So that's like... Kid, are you okay? Actually, do you want to know something? Like the odds is, your armor is better than mine. So um, be, a, be a darling and give me some of that. Mmm. Mmm. Yep, we're... Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. That's definitely a stronger start than what most other people would probably have at this point. But considering I am lucky with the one... Well, not so much the... You dodgy little bitch. Unfortunately, I'm not exactly the best at free aiming, so that doesn't exactly apply to me. Got this. Happy days. Moving onwards. And we are going to kill a rat. Happy days. Okay, guys. Plus... Plus side, and I pointed this out in the network test, if anybody doesn't know I know this here, is you can also get, um, you can massively increase your, you can massively increase your resistances if you do indeed have, um, more humanity. So, the more humanity normally the better. Excuse me, kid. Oh, you're such a dead bitch. Yoink. Can you not? Thank you. And um, yep, my memory's not my memory ain't too shabby yet. As far as I yep, nothing in there. Right. Now we go a lot of people don't actually know about this, but well, actually, um there's that way there too. But this can very quickly if you're not if you're not prepared for a fight, this area can very quickly eliminate you. So it can because the amount of friggin' undead there is. This area can very quickly eliminate you if you're not careful. Pop! Um, pop! Oh no! Oh! Guys, nostalgia through the roof. So we're not going to need any of the really high powered spells yet. Because if we're, wa if we're one shot now. Excuse me. Excuse me! 
Thank you. Now, can you get off too? Can you get off? Can you not? Fine, we'll do it that way. How's that sound? Huh? Good? 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 Dickhead. Right. Okay, then. I'll do it. Right. I think we got said twin humanities here, which is obviously going to be mwah, perfect. Because it's just going to be awesome. Oh, no, it's just a single humanity. Bollocks! Oh, well. We'll be able to pick up twin humanities later on. And as long as we can get our hands on a lot of humanity early game, we are actually really, really well off. So, I can't really argue with that there. Right. Another soul. Another day. Right. Something just randomly has died. Dragon! You will notice that I'll probably end up staying more than likely hollow for a lot of this. There we go. Somebody's already grave lording. Oh my god. Somebody is already grave lording. I can guarantee you now that he's probably pimped to the high heavens. Which is going to be an absolute nightmare to deal with. And uh, as far as I actually know, um, his grave lording shouldn't take too much effect on me. I'm not 100% accurate on that one, so. Disaster are gone after the defeat. Okay. Disasters are gone. Okay. So somebody did defeat him, which is kind of interesting due to the fact that I'm presuming that he was probably high. Well, unless he did a suicide run straight through the catacombs, it's a very high possibility that he did do that. I wouldn't put it past anybody to do that. This is Dark Souls. Smacky smacky. Right, can, like, I would really like to gather up enough souls so I can, like, uh, fidget about for a few things. Because, um, you're a traitor and I kind of need you to give me a few bits. You have the dried fingers. That is going to be something, yeah, I need this. That is going to be something I will be purchasing of you in a later stage. That's okay, that's all I need. Because literally the only thing I'm going to require throughout this entire playthrough. Do I need anything that goes down that way? No, it just brings me to the heavy crossbow if my memory serves me correct. Which I'm not sure it does. So, well, well, you're going to have to take my hunch on this one. So, uh, let's pop off whatever souls we've got. And hope to God we got something. Five of these. Oh, yeah. And one of these. So please allow me to level up my intelligence so I can get a bit more damage going. Uh, likely not going to be the case. Give or take. But we'll see anyway. Right, so level up and intellect. Two points. Oh well, overall increases my damage, so I'm not going to argue too heavily much on that one. Bugger you and your shield, but it can one-shot you, so that's actually a good thing. Ooh, a short sword. Can I wield it? I can. This is good. Even though it's not going to be like terribly needed, per se, like, but for now it's good. Until that happens. R1 spam, boys. I failed horribly on that one. I do apologize. Give me your shield, would you? I know, backstab fishing. I'm, I'm, I'm a shame. So I'm, I'm a damn shame. Can you like put away your shield for two seconds? Thank you. Thank you. And moving up. We're moving up in the world, guys. We're moving up. Still no decent armors though, so. Mmm, we're not exactly going to be the best off, but for now, we're, we should be grand. Spell spammers! I'm a spell spammer! Nothing's worse than Dark Souls 2 spell spam. Yeah, I'm always going to... Dark Souls 2, I enjoyed it, so I did, but seriously, towards the end of the lifespan of that game, it got dirty. Like, it was just dirty. More souls, and I picked up a humanity from them too. That is actually pretty damn good. Go up here. Shiv him in the back, which was accidental. Did not actually mean to shiv him in the back, but okay. Uh, and then back to the spell spam. 
The fact that I'm able to one-shot these guys is disgusting at this level of the game, and it's, it, it, I'm using the base spell. Are you, can you just die already? Thank you. God, diggity dang. Right. So down here is gold pine resins, and we're gonna actually <laughs> we're gonna suicide. We're gonna go up against the black knight. This is gonna be fun. Right, come on. would have been dead from that. Can you not? Asshole. Should have been dead from that. I'm going to point that out now. That he should have been dead from that. <sighs> Give me a fucking heart attack. Not exactly on my to-do list, thank you very much. Headshot. And he gives me nothing, right? I don't think I have the physical strength to wield that. Oh, but I do two handed. Um that also puts me over my equip load. There we go. Yep, everybody immediately knows what Mark's gonna do. Everybody immediately knows what kind of death wish I have. Well, what can I say? I've got a death wish. Leave me alone. That missed. Oh yeah, this is this is this is not good. Right, Havel. How are you doing today? How's your janky how's your janky um How's your janky hitboxes? Backstab fishing for day. This is the first test of your true backstab capabilities. And that there's the first capability of him just turning around going wombo combo. I don't give no shits about your fucking backstabs, bitch. Yeah, that just happened. Fucking joys, eh? I'm gonna roll smoke. Give me a moment. Did a little did do. Cannot believe he just fucking just turned around and wombo comboed me. Humpy mother. Just breathe, just breathe, you should have seen it coming, you shouldn't have been doing this here whenever you're rusty as fuck at the game, but sure, I've got a death wish, so we're just going to work with that. And yes, I know, it was a stupid idea, but it's a case of fucking ah well. In fairness, I would like to get my shit back, come to think of it. Right, I'm trying to figure out which cunt stabbed me in the back whenever I went over here. Wow, that tracking. That tracking's impressive. I'll give it that much. Oh, hi. Uh, fire bombs are not nice. And you healed. No, 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 no. Behave, game. You know that was bullshit. Alright, let's move onwards. Let's get back to where we were at and trying to kill Havel. On we go. Nuke you, nuke you. And nuke you. Job done. And then we'll go out here. Because these guys can't hit me. And nuke them. One by one. In the back. Excuse me. Thank you. How I, how I managed to get past that one. I don't know. I seen that, go, that knife going right into my ribs. But sure. Logic. You didn't drop me on you, bitch. Right. 
Back to round two. I didn't say this was going to be a deathless run. There's my shit there. Yo, Havel! Can you be nice to me this time? Or can I just like spell cheese you? Because backstab cheesing kind of failed with me the last time. Okay, right, let's try and do the ballsy route. Are you taking the piss game? Thought so. Uh-oh. That was not very wise of me. Now, a lot of you will probably be wondering, why are you using the Morningstar over the uh, dagger? Because the dagger has better critical. I'm using the Morningstar for its bleed. Which technically should have proc there, but uh, I forgot Havel's armor has a shit ton of bleed resist. Whew. I may have forgotten about that small factor. Uh, excuse me, Havel, should you not have bled out by now? <laughs> <laughs> I think I might just come back here at a later stage whenever I'm actually able to kill him. <laughs> hmm. And fuck that, I'll just meet you. Fuck's sake. Fuck's sake. Just fuck's sake. I can't. Fuck. Havel, bitch. I'm not confident in fighting the bitch yet. Oh, what? Who, what, where now then? Oh, hang on, wait there. Oh, well, mm, I quite like the shield. Game? English? Do you speak it? Okay, seriously. I'm getting fed up with people jumping me. Stop. Right. Back at it we are. Fuck me. At least I'm going to have plenty of souls by the time I'm done this shit. Okay, job done. Nuke you. Nuke you. And finally we're going to nuke you too. Oh, you dropped me a, you t dropped me a tasty. What did you drop me? Hollow Soldier Helmet. Mm, not a bad thing, like, but not a good thing either. Asshole. Right. Back to our suicide mission, I guess. Well, hang on, actually. Do you want to know something? We'll try the dagger out to see if it actually has any better results, which I doubt. Honestly, guys, I do doubt that it's going to have a better result, like, but it's one of those things that you just have to test and test and test and test. 4,000 souls I've saved up from trying to kill this guy. 4,000 souls. Nope. Doesn't matter if I'm in low health or not, because I'm going to die either way, so backstab fish. Oh, that is not very good. I think I'll stick with the bleed. I love how the blue tear stone ring doesn't even, ta doesn't even activate against this guy. He just hits that hard. Alright, stand back up. Let me have you. Let me have a smack at you. Alright. Wombo combos, boys. Stop, Havel. Behave. Are you serious? You still haven't bled out yet. But it staggered you. But you still haven't bled out yet. Can you, like, bleed out already? Like, what is your bleed bar? There we go. That's what I was looking for. Because it would take me forever to whittle down this guy's health bar. Backstab fishing. Then we get a wee hidden just to say hi, you know. Alright, come on over here. 
That was the attack that killed me the last time. Don't follow up. Good boy. Hoo-hoo-hoo. -hoo. Slow weapons, people. And a big ass shield. Oh, no, you're not doing that shit. Fuck off. Hoo-hoo-hoo. No, Havel, behave. Your first major practice in backstab fishing. And bleed kills him. Okay, I can live with that. Uh, short sword. And thank you for the Havel's ring. Increases your equip load by a stupid amount, which means that you can equip a bucket ton of defense whenever you really want to. Hang on, actually, let me see here. I'll be taking that. Thank you very much. And back on we go. Because as of right now, we are basically grandish. I think. Give or take. Oh, uh, well, we'll find out once we get up the length. Right. See these boys? These boys are very important to you throughout the entire game. Well, actually, no, up until you get to a point where you've got like a metric shit ton of souls that you don't know what to spend on. Like, seriously, there's a, like, late game, there's actually a fucking place, or a person that actually sells those. The only thing that isn't sold is Demon Titanite, which is, like, barbarically bad, because, like, how you meant to upgrade, like, weapons that were gotten off a friggin' boss. Job done, job done. Right. Now we are going to try the most, utmost, uh, uh, what? You can't, I'm pretty sure, you, oh, wait, I think. I don't know anymore. Yo, Taurus, demon, come to me. Say, ah. Oh, that is bad. That is bad. That is very bad. Very bad. Very bad. Whoo! This is not good. This is very not good. Very not good. Very not good. Oh shit, now I'm going to die to the first actual bo- well, second actual boss. Oh my god, my cast speed is diabolically slow. Um, how? I am unsure to how I dodged that. Leap, and forward, and forward again. Beat out and attack. Oh, not that one. Didn't expect that one to hit me. No. Bad Taurus Demon. Bad. I think the first time I ever beat this Taurus Demon, right? I, I Bearing in mind, right? The first time I ever beat this Taurus Demon, I was relatively new to Dark Souls. Bear that one in mind, right? I beat him by him falling off the edge. Like, he's such an asshole to be fighting in this area, so he is, because it's just a tight little bridge that you can't get past, and he just fucks your shit up, basically. Which is just so many levels of unfair. And so. And we've got 10 grand souls as well, so that means we can upgrade our intelligence quite a bit. Until we're required to actually wield our weapon, which is not very good. Yes, hello, hello, Solaire. How are you doing today? Are you doing well? Ah, uh, no, that was not what I was looking. This is what I get for repeatedly button mashing. Yes, thank you very much. No, oh my. Mm, I forgot it's got a double option. Right, yes. Thank you, jolly cooperation, yay! I'll not be taking uh, part in jolly cooperation for a wee while. So on that, because I'll be primarily focused on trying to get this shit done. Because I have to get this build up to a decent level, uh, that I can invade! Whoo! I thought I went off the edge there. So yeah. I have to get this build up to a point that I'm allowed to invade with, and then go have some shenanigans. That's that one done. I haven't rested on a... Nope, I haven't rested on a previous bonfire. Probably should rest at a bonfire, but... Meh. 
Stupid. Thou art. Right, no more heart attacks, please, game. Please, just no more heart attacks. And you, sir, can get the hell out of my way. Are you serious? Can you not just die? Thank you. Actually, now that I think about it, there is actually a weapon I want to get my hands on. But that there's more late game based and I'm poisoned. This is not good, not good, not good, not good, not good, not good. Rats, good source of humanity. Bad source of poison though. And before you even ask, yes, I do know about the Drake Sword, but I'm not bothering with the Drake Sword. Uh, come to hang out, I should actually not be, uh, yeah, that's just, yeah. I do know, I, I do know about the Drake Sword, I just, I'm not bothering with the Drake Sword, because there's no point in me going out of my way to get the Drake Sword whenever I'm going to be using it for, like, two minutes. So, that's just, that's just me going to point that one out. Level up, and we're going to increase our intelligence yet again. Ooh, 28. That's a little bit high, actually, now to think about it. So we'll upgrade that to... 28, I said, yeah. Right, so we'll upgrade that there to 24. Then upgrade our vitality to 10. And then our endurance up by 2. And then that there should be that. And we are now officially level 16. So we are. So that's actually pretty good because then that gives you... If I'm level 16 now, then that means by the time you reach the Undead Parish, you're going to be in around the 25 range. Now that there's that, that there's just... I have to take notes as I'm making my way through this here because of a very special reason. We're going to be doing low-level invasions like a dickhead. You know, just just the usual stuff, you know? Actually, do you know what I might need? I'm going to need to get my hands on a magic weapon earlier rather than later because... We're running around with just magic. Yeah, it's, a, it's effective and all, but you just. It's just not as effective as you would 9 times out of 10 wish, is my point. So you immediately see me. That's just like dickatry at its, at its finest. Hello, rat. How are you doing today? No humanities this time for me, boys? No. Ah, well. So, obviously. Coming up this ladder, we are now at the legitimate part of where the network test took place. We are going to be going up to the Black Knight and shiving him in the ribs a couple of times just to see what I can get away with. <laughs> that never gets old. Never gets old. Well, he's just here, but I do guarantee he'll probably end up one-shotting me or something stupid. Oh, and of course he's going to one-shot me. He's a Black Knight. It's kind of expected. He is kind of stupid just for standing there, like, but, okay. I have been caught off guard by this guy in the past. He's quite a bitch at times. If you do, if you, if you do the smallest thing out of place or out of turn or out of anything, he can really mess your shit up. And I'm getting, I'll be honest, I'm getting a tad bit in the lucky side with the parries here. I'll be honest, I will throw my hands up and say that. Especially out there, like, lunge attack, that there's, de yeah, I'm definitely getting lucky. I think the Black Knight's just like, eh. He, oh, oh, he's fed up with my shit. Yeah, he really is fed up with my shit considering he started to back off. That's not exactly a good sign. It's the fact that their AI has actually improved quite a substantial amount. Like, I don't think they ever did that prior. There we go. Happy days, and on we go. More souls, all the better. Obviously, a lot of people will not be able to do what I'm doing as of yet, but it's just a bit of fun. It's my skill versus theirs. It's, there's nothing really much I can say about it. Ooh, but the, the boar is going to be a, is going to be the pain, the painful part of this one, because without the well, maybe actually not. Maybe you can just bully him with spells, which is also a very high possibility at this point. Right? Can you like come here? Thank you. <clears throat> just kind of like kill you, you know? Ooh, I know what I could turn this build into. Right, seriously, I just want to, I just want to kill him. I just want to kill him. I just want to kill him. Let me kill him. Thank you. Chug. Back to full health. Wow. That is like. 
disgusting. Are you always this much of an asshole? I didn't mean to shoot the boar. I meant to shoot you. And how did you survive that? Me using high powered spells and you're just shaking it off like it's nothing? Excuse me. Shaking it off like it's nothing. Excuse me. Have some manners. And the boar didn't drop his helmet, which is a bit bad, but ah well, we'll continue on. Have some more fun and see what we can get away with. Okay. Yes, run, run, run as fast as you can. Can't catch me, I'm the gingerbread man. Yeah, we all right, figured that one out. I love how the only death I have sustained so far is... Well, the only two deaths I've sustained so far is against Havel. Er, er, er. Excuse me, I can't, I can't have you ass-raping me now. That is unfair and not obliged. Unfair, good sir. And on to the mowing match we go. This we'll need for a later time, because that's actually going to be the worst time possible. Or is it? Ah, oh, it is, because it's actually going... Yeah, it is. Never mind. But we should have... That, that will be fun later on, because we will get a very nice piece of armor. And some more souls for us to collect. Happy days. And up we go. And okay, right, let's go. So now we get into the now we get into the funner set. As everybody's always seen this here from the network test, it's literally a direct rip, which isn't a bad thing, but. And I can one shot boulder knights, especially the ones with the rapiers. This is good. I I I like this. This is this is this is this thumbs up. Thumbs up. Because then that means it'll be a pissing match whenever it comes to later on. If I'm alright this powerful, it'll be an absolute pissing match later on. There we go, job done. And run in here, run back out, because there's a hollow soldier on one side and him. Him is the one that we are looking. And he was stupid enough to try and take a chug out of Estus. You're smart. Now you kindly die. Thank you. So now, we, well, once we get the residence key, we'll be more or less set. We'll deal with the Algarid Girls in a bit. Once I go, I activate the next bonfire, and that's more or less the job of it. Basement key, and then open this here in case we do end up dying like a stupid tit. And then we'll pick up the halberd, because that there's also going to be useful. And then we go bomb the show in here. Now, bearing in mind, I'm going to be limited to what I'm going to be able to do in about five minutes. So, make use of what you can, while you can. You actually took down your guard just so you could get shot in the face. I feel so sorry for you, good sir. And uh, now we've got... Oh, somebody's actually managed to... Fuck me, people are people have been busy. And now the fucking Chandler's taking pop shots at me too! Stop. Oh, really? Oh, right, you're gonna, you're gonna sit and chug now, are you? Are you you're, gonna, you're just gonna, you're just gonna t chug that sunny D. Like, all the new people that are going to be in this game, like myself, that is also chugging Sunny D consistently. Trying to get away with that one? No, not really. Right. So, all in all, so far, what, we have one-shotted 99.9% .9 of the enemies through here? And now down to Andre, where the majority of our shit spraying will take place more or less because um, he's going to be the, the main upgrade person that you're going to be using throughout the entirety of the game and I've also got five grand along with a couple of souls that I can spend and get my intelligence up that little bit higher as well as you can see I don't really care for my health all that much even though that whenever I do end up getting hit I'm going to get absolutely slaughtered uh, hang on there's a few things I can think of here off the top of my head if I can think easily Um. well first of all souls because we're not particularly going to be upgrading anything due to the fact that all we have is magic based 
So upgrading weapons would be technically pointless at this moment in time. I think. I think that's the maths behind it, but um weapons. So we currently have a longsword. Is there any reason for us to change up what we're using? Probably not, but I would like a more decent piece of armor, which I'm actually gonna go obtain right now. We're gonna level up and increase our intelligence to twenty-six. So we are and move onwards. Uh, what are we deal with this guy? Because we can. Well, Andre, how are you doing? Modify equipment, obviously nothing to modify. Reinforce equipment, we cannot reinforce our long sword, which would probably be a good idea at some point. Reinforce armor, purchase items. He sells a uh, technic charge. That there is something we're gonna have to get as soon as possible, and obviously all of those as well. He also sells long sword weapons, broad axe, war pick. Ooh, live. There's actually a few fun bits in there, and then learn gestures. Hurrah! Yep, now we are going to try, well actually we're not going to try, we're going to cheese. Or maybe not cheese? Okay. Can you not? Thought I was bad for spell spam and you're worse. Stop coming closer. I said stop. So yeah. Um quite literally the cheese is real with this build. Build. I have barely even started building. But yeah, much of a much less I'm cheesy as fuck. <laughs> now on to the fun shenanigans. So basically the reason why we're coming in this length is because there's a piece of there's a set of armor in here that I want. And I want it now. There's also a good few souls to be got in here too. Um we could actually go get a another very unique piece of armor, but that is going to be difficult at the point that we are at. Due to the fact of, well, assholes. Stop. Back it up. Back it up. Right. Okay then. We'll do it your way. Oh, I hit for minuscule damage. Yeah, I'm going to need a new catalyst at some point, you know. But then again, this is like the best catalyst you can get up until like near the damn end. So... Not exactly the best thing possible, I guess. But sure, we'll have some shenanigans. Remember that key, a uh, crest of Artorias? That's where it goes in there. And for a lot of people that may not know, voila! Ooh, I'm sitting thinking here now. Right. We've got five of these left. So I do. Okay, I make that four. Because I was an idiot. So for anybody who doesn't know, you can, I think you can actually get drag them out one at a time. If you know where you're looking. Bop. And finally. Bop. Oh, shit. Not intentional. Alright. More souls. More poison moss clumps. That's always actually really good. And uh, we shall move onwards from here. Now for the shenanigans. Right, these stone armor guys are actually quite like strong at this point of the game. So we're going to see if we can actually harm them with magic. Oh, not very good. Okay, that's not good. What was that? And they can damn near one shot me as well, so that's going to be a that's going to be a conholy of a problem, but basically what we are after is right here. The elite knight gear. Now fucking run. 
Run, 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 run. Move it. Okay, then. That's what we came for, because uh, with the com combination of Havel's ring, we should be able to wear at least one or two pieces of this gear. Wearing one of two of these pieces of gear will obviously drastically increase our chances of living. Because uh, I think it's class as a medium to heavy, I think. It's not class as massive, because I think there's only, what, one, one, two, three, four armors that classifies that, so I'm quite happy with the way this is turning out so far. But obviously there is also um, plenty of things that can go wrong. Right, Elite Knight leggings, Elite Knight gloves, and Elite Knight chest piece. Let's see. No, medium rolling. Fast rolling. Fast rolling. Medium rolling. There we go. So there's, there's the extent of what we can do. Which is immediately from that point on, from this point onwards, we are now substantially harder to kill. Straight up given. Alright, Andre, how are you doing? Modify equipment? Uh, no, repair. Yeah, well, we'll repair our gear because we're going to need the repairs. Seeing as this now repair all, reinforce armor, reinforce the leggings. We got more souls while we were floating about. So we did, so let's get them used up too. And then... Can we stop doing that? Please! There we go. 2,000 souls, that is tasty. I accidentally hit leave, like a smart person. Level up, and two more into magic. Level 20 and we already have a shit ton of uh, magic behind us. This I'm getting used to. And obviously our power will increase gradually as well. I think is it 30 dexterity increases your cast speed. I think it's that. Give or take, I'm not sure. So I'm not, but we'll find out in, in time. Really, he's all just stood there. Uh, yeah, we'll go do this first. So that means we can continue on from the next part. But then, let me see here, right? So we've got this, then okay, and then okay. Right, I'm just trying to make a, make a, like a, an actual, like, print in my brain to figure out what's on the to-do list. And this is one of them. Right. So, from here onwards, obviously, everybody's going to be wondering, Oh, no, I missed the jump! Well, that just happened. Well, that just happened. Right. I don't need to go up there just yet, but it would be very sort of prominent to do it now while I can. Is my point. Hey, look. Somebody else who is actually in the game that is, uh, has not given up yet. I am actually remarkably surprised. Because sometimes people tend to give up quite quickly at this game. Yeah, I know. I, 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 granted, it can be hard if you don't know what you're doing. But I'm not there. It's actually quite easy. Well, not so much quite easy. If you know how to cheese the game like I am, it's quite easy. What? Don't look at me like that. Don't look at me like that. Wow, that line's actually quite impressive. Right. So obviously we haven't gotten to the OP shit yet. Obviously, I could go get the OP shit immediately, but then where's the fun in that? Because then that means I'm just steamrolling the game. Actually, quite frankly, I already am steamrolling the game, and this is what it's going to consist of, because it's just... Fudge! Yeah, I'm going to need it. I'm going to actually need, like, an actual weapon at some point. Asshole. That was unnecessary. Did you just chug? Did you... Did you just chug? You asshole. Right, channel A. Let's party. Hang on, let's see. Can I hit you without you getting your buff off?
Cheese! And he didn't drop anything. That's a damn shame. Run forward, back out, because the channeler's buff is ridiculously OP and it uh, increases like all damage like by like, a stupid amount. So now we sit back and spell spam to our heart's content. Don't like channelers, don't like channelers whenever it's next to a lot of enemies, don't like channelers whenever they're buffed and they're able to like one shot you with a fucking trident spin, asshole. Right, eight heavy soul arrows. Wow, we are going to be. Um, this may not end as well as I'm hoping here. Depending on how hard our spells can hit, we may be restricted to our weapons. This is not good. If I had an extra set of spells, I'd be happy, but I don't think I do. Could have bought an extra set of spells. I'm a tit. Well, it's one of those things that just. Have to smile, grin and bear it. Yes, I know you're stuck, Law Track. How are you doing today, good sir? Let you out. Say hi. Goodbye. Right. Normally, yes, most people will kill him to get the fat ring. It's just a great. It is straight up just a given. People will kick him off the edge and get the fat ring. But considering I'm a caster, I'll not be doing that there. Yay. You know. Just yay. More souls for me. Right then. Ah, oh, we're approaching the R, the R points we are, so if we can finish this up too sweet, we should be good. We can finish this in at about an hour and we'll be grand. Can't argue with that, can we? Right, let's go kill ourselves some gargoyles. Let's hope we don't die. Hope is the most opportune word because you are an asshole damage on the other hand is quite significant I'm a tit you know that I'm, 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 I'm an actual tit are you genuinely taking the piss game Oh yeah, that's right, I forgot the entire reason why we, we went down to Farling Shrine in the first place. Can I, like, lock on to this guy? Thank you. This game just does not want to cooperate with me at the minute. Sit still for two seconds so I can shoot you. Oh my god. Yes, that connected when he was in mid-fucking-air. A surprising range as well. That's always good. And now we've got the second gargoyle to contend with. So we're going to chug. Are you not meant to be dead? He was one hit from death. One hit. He was one hit. One hit. One hit. From. Did I just get that? Did I just. Did I, did I just get the Gargoyle Halberd? Like, one of the, the best weapons, like, in the game. 16-12. Ooh. That's not very good. That's not very good at all. Right, uh, let's go ring the bells, head back down, give the Firekeeper our soul, and our soul to reinforce our Estus. Then we have to deal with the Moon Knight Butterfly, and the rest of that area. Then we have to go down into the depths, and then Blight Town. So yeah, we're, we're, we've got we've got quite a bit to deal with. And hopefully, quite a bit that we'll be able to deal with. I'm hoping. Yay! Ring the bell on Dead Church. Right, hold. There we go. Now it works. So I'm going to presume that the Elite Knight armor saved my ass on that one because I wasn't feeling very sort of good about that one. But hopefully, well, dude, Cod Oswald. Right, uh, can I make justice? And you also have the rings. Uh, Lauren Jester, well, what is it? It's the legendary emote of the giant dad. No. Or is it? 
<laughs> it's the legendary emote of the giant dad. <laughs> right. So with all that done, right, let's head back to the bonfire. Now, if I'm thinking here, sorry, I did accidentally just hit my mic. Um, if I'm thinking here, what is it that I need to think about, think about, think about, think about? There's something I was going to say. Wobbly, 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 wobbly. Oh, right, right, well, we're more or less in the right place. So we are, we're going to level up our intelligence just that smidgen more. So we are. We're reaching our intelligence cap. We're actually reaching our intelligence cap quite quickly, which is actually kind of shocking. Hello, oh, Law Track, how you doing? You look green. Are you sure you're well there, mate? Thank you very much. And now talk to you and give us an uh, SS flask, right? Okay, so, um, right, so this will be the main playthrough and this will be my caster build. Um, I will be doing other builds and things like that there, like dexterity builds and things like that there, uh, obviously in the time to come, and then PvP of course, but um, if anybody wants to see something, because I'll be doing a level 1 playthrough, so I will and things like that there, I'm not a challenge runner, guys, I'm not a challenge runner, uh, I'll be, I will be doing a level 1 playthrough just for the cracks of it, um, other than that there, I'll be doing like, just other things really. So guys, this is Lemeth Gaming, I hope you've all enjoyed, and I will see you all in the next video. Please like, share, and subscribe. Don't forget to hit the bell icon if you do decide to subscribe, don't know that they're good shit. So guys, this is Lemeth Gaming, I hope you've all enjoyed, and guys, I shall see you all in the next video. Goodbye!